Winky the Rat is here to eat, squeak, and burrow herself into both the world of Don't Stop Together and our hearts, everyone. Well, if we're in the vile vermin, that is. But hold up, Beard. I don't see this character listed bloody anywhere. What gives? Ah, yes. That's because Winky is not a solo mod. She's actually a character from our old friend, Uncompromising Mode. But from Rat Armies to Stinky Foodies, let us just give a wink to Winky, shall we? And we will start, as we always do, with an overview of her ratty stats. Winky exits her burrow, resting at 150 hunger, 125 sanity, and 175 health, respectively. It's not bad. Darn near average for sure. However, that lower than normal sanity might come to bite us in the butt quicker than we think. For you see, Winky here is a rat, and rats love stuff. But if Winky drops her stuff, and I mean like any of her stuffs, she will instantly lose 5 sanity per dropped item. Now this includes things like armor, backpacks, and clothing too. So if you're a hoarder, this mod's for you. But hold up once more, Beard. The heck was staring at us during that stat segment. Are you just gonna ignore that? Ah, yes, once again. That was Winky's home burrow, everyone. At the cost of 20 hunger, she will create a permanent home burrow wherever she pleases. But that's not all. Any follow-up burrows will then cost 15 hunger each, and as long as you've got the hunger, you can make as many of these as you bloody want. But what do all of these burrows actually do, you ask? Well, additional quote-unquote small burrows can be used by Winky to not only spawn friendly rats for 20 hunger each up to three times per burrow, but all burrows are also all connected and act like chests. As an added bonus, said chests are actually 12 slots each too. Very, very nice. Do note though, that all small burrows will despawn in roughly a minute, while home burrows can only be moved via a shovel. Oh. And yes, other players can indeed interact with these burrows too, so coordinate accordingly for easy loot transfers. But what about them follower rat beard? Are they any good for us and what do they do? Well, surprisingly enough, not much. I thought they'd gather up nearby resources for us, just like how natural rats do for themselves in uncompromising mode like crazy, but no. They don't. It seems to me they're just allies for combat at the end of the day. That said, with their crazy numbers, 100 health and 20 damage a munch, they're truly not bad in that regard. Oh, and yes, given that Winky herself is literally a rat, she can also just befriend naturally spawning rats with food. So it'd truly be a strength in numbers thing, if you know what I mean. And the more I thought of it, perhaps that was entirely the point. As would you believe it, the constant doesn't take too kindly to a humanoid rat running around. Pigs, bunnymen, and cat coons will attack our new monster friend on sight, so be aware of that. But that's not all. I'm guessing the insane amount of rats at hand is gonna be there to counter Winky's 25% less damage overall, as, well, Winky deals 25% less damage overall, mind you. Now all that said though, she's also got ways to avoid conflict if needed, as she's actually 15% faster than others during the day and dusk, which is always a plus, as speed is key. However, things get even better come nightfall, as her speed increases to 25% faster overall, which is the equivalent of having a walking cane on at all times. It's not bad. Not bad at all, especially in the caves. But before we wrap up with the usuals, some final notes here on what Winky likes to and can end up eating. Being a rat, she is used to eating crap, sometimes literally. But for us here today, she will eat things like pig skin, slurper pelts, and she might, just might dabble in a bit of cannibalism if you let her do so. But her favorite food around town is powder cake, believe it or not. And while the stuff typically does absolutely nothing for anyone, Winky will net 35 hunger, 15 sanity, and 15 health per Twinkie-esque bite. And that's pretty darn good stuff. But yes, it is time to say goodbye already with a shot of Winky's ghost here and a listen in on her voice. Enjoy. And 
There you have it, everyone. Winky, the vile vermin for Don't Stop Together here. Well, for uncompromising mode, I guess, but you get the idea. Honestly, I like it. I like her. So much so, that I would consider making her a solo mod, expanding her mechanics, and even adding more interactions with the world, like with mole worm burrows, rabbit holes even, wormholes for sure, etc. I'd play her. That's for sure. Thanks for watching, folks. Well, wishes to all. Squeak, squeak. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.